Welcome to this Brompton Technology Feature Spotlight. Introducing Brompton HDR. HDR stands for High Dynamic Range and it is one of the most exciting video technology developments in recent times. It is already widely supported in the consumer market, in high-end televisions, streaming services, Blu-ray and even some of the recent gaming consoles. In this feature spotlight, we will look at what HDR is and how our Tessera LED processors can deliver its impressive image depth and vivid lifelike quality. When compared to SDR, or standard dynamic range, HDR video involves the capture and reproduction of footage with a much greater dynamic range. Dynamic range refers to the amount of information represented between the brightest and darkest areas of an image. It is also often referred to as the contrast ratio in display systems. With its ability to show much more detail between the light and dark areas, HDR video comes out as being much sharper, vibrant and overall much more lifelike. For every pixel, HDR primarily delivers three image quality improvements. The first, and probably most important improvement, is a vastly increased brightness range. Having an increased brightness range is crucial for displaying the high level of detail contained within HDR imagery. Human eyes can respond to a wide range of light intensities at any one time, but they do so in a non-linear fashion. At the darker end of an image, small differences in brightness are easily perceived as visible detail. However, much greater differences in brightness are required for human eyes to perceive a change in luminosity within the brighter parts of an image. The increased brightness range of HDR allows it to distribute the luminosity of played content to look more lifelike to our eyes. The majority of any image we see on screen is usually relatively restrained in terms of brightness. This means that most of the detail we see is contained within the lower brightness levels. This leaves a considerable amount of the brightness range for representing the brighter parts of the image. Often, this is referred to as the brightness headroom of HDR. Within this headroom, the bright parts can be displayed in a way the human eye can see, and it allows images to even show elements that require extreme brightness, such as explosions, specular highlights, or intense light sources like the sun. Used in this manner, the increased brightness range which is capable of also displaying extreme brightness, allows HDR to create detailed, realistic visual impact. The second improvement is the use of a wider colour gamut, which isn't just about increased saturation, but rather an even greater range of available colours to create stunning, realistic imagery. The wider colour gamut is achieved by using primary targets of a more intense and saturated colour for the RGB channels. These are capable of producing both a wider range of colours as well as more saturated ones when needed. The CIE colour space describes all the colours within the visible spectrum for humans. SDR typically uses the REC709 colour space, which covers as little as 36% of this CIE. For movie projection, the slightly wider colour gamut of the DCI-P3 colour space is typically favoured. This offers improved coverage at 54% of the CIE. By contrast, HDR is commonly created using the REC 2020 colour space. This covers 74% of the CIE, thus offering a much wider colour gamut. The third improvement is the use of a higher bit depth. This allows us to describe the increased brightness range and wider colour gamut of HDR content. Almost all SDR content that consumers see uses 8-bit colour, also known as true colour. This is where each of the three primary RGB colours of a pixel are defined by an 8-bit number. An 8-bit number is capable of describing 256 levels of brightness for each primary channel. Together, this allows for just over 16.7 million different colours. By contrast, the HDR standard recommends using at least 10-bit colour. This gives each of the RGB primary colour channels a minimum of 1024 possible brightness levels. 
that is four times as many levels than offered by 8-bit colour. When put together, this produces one billion different colours to describe each pixel. The big advantage of this is the ability to show much smoother colour gradients and transitions, with less banding occurring. If HDR were to be mastered with only an 8-bit depth, it would display severe banding and artefacts. Attempting to describe HDR with an 8-bit depth would produce insufficient colour definitions to represent the REC 2020 colour space. Such HDR would look worse than SDR to the viewer. However, with a 10-bit depth, there are enough levels to represent both the increased brightness range and wider colour gamut of HDR. Good quality LED screens are particularly well suited for displaying HDR with its image quality improvements. Unlike most other display technologies, LEDs can be incredibly bright in the thousands of nits, meaning they already have the brightness range to deliver the high contrast ratio necessary for HDR. Furthermore, unlike other display technologies, LED pixels within a panel work independently from one another, meaning a fully illuminated pixel can be next to one that is completely off, making for a much sharper image. Today's high-quality LEDs are capable of producing highly saturated colours. These can cover almost the entire REC 2020 colour space, commonly used for HDR. In summary, HDR consists primarily of three image quality improvements. An increased brightness range, wider colour gamut, and higher bit depth. This creates an image that is sharper, more detailed, and perceived by our eyes as more vivid and lifelike. Interestingly, a unique property of HDR is that it is resolution agnostic, meaning it will improve image quality at all resolutions and frame rates. Even a lower resolution screen with good quality LEDs, capable of meeting the brightness and color requirements of HDR content, will show a dramatic improvement and even appear to be of a higher resolution. Brompton HDR offers a new approach capable of delivering impressive image quality improvements on LED. However, it is a much more demanding process. Compared to SDR, HDR involves handling and displaying much more information, from capture all the way through to your screen. At Brompton, we have ensured our systems fully support and correctly handle the metadata and colour accuracy that are an integral part of the HDR standard in order to deliver a fully featured HDR experience. We have completely reworked our processing pipeline to support and precisely propagate all information from an HDR video input through the processor, network, data distribution units, all the way to the LED panel receiver cards. Brompton HDR is exclusive to our Tessera SX40 and S8 LED processors. Both accept video input at up to 12-bit colour and support the two most common HDR formats, PQ as specified in ST2084 and used for HDR10, and Hybrid Log Gamma, HLG, offering compatibility with a wide range of HDR video sources via SDI or HDMI 2.0. All industry standard colour spaces are supported, including REC 709, DCI-P3 and REC 2020, as well as custom ones that can be set in real time. Our systems make use of the metadata to automatically set the format and colour space for the content playing as the video is received. We also include all the tools needed for our users to define or override how the incoming video input is interpreted on the fly. Our Tessera LED processors can seamlessly switch between SDR and HDR content streams on any single input without interrupting video output, allowing for back-to-back -back display of various content sources. All existing Tessera features are fully compatible with HDR content and available on our Tessera SX40 and Tessera S8 processors ensuring you receive exceptional HDR performance and a fully optimized experience. In order to deliver Brompton HDR, your LED panels must both be fitted with an R2 receiver card 
and calibrated using our dynamic calibration technology. To learn more about dynamic calibration and Brompton HDR, we recommend going to the dynamic calibration feature spotlight next. Dynamic calibration is our HDR enabling technology that unleashes the full potential of LED panels for a truly stunning HDR experience. This concludes our feature spotlight on Brompton HDR. We hope you have learned more about what makes HDR an exciting video technology and how our Tesra LED processors are capable of delivering its impressive image quality. Thank you for watching.